He's diagnosed with stage four chronic kidney disease. And the doctor was telling him that because he had a blood draw on October the 5th, his granular filtration rate is 19.5. The doctor required, nephrologist required him to prepare for dialysis or on the transplant list. And I invited him to come to Cabo with a vacation with me. So when he arrived at the November the 12th in Cabo San Lucas, Mexico. So I sitting there and I say, I can smell you. You have kidney problem. And he looked at me, turned around, looked at me, said, well, you're right. Remember the blah, 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 how many years ago he started telling me this story. I said, you're not good. You need to get treatment. And he said, sure, I'm available, whatever you want me to do. So starting from the November the 12th, I treat him every day until November the 17th. So totally about six treatments. And then we finish our vacation, we go home and he went to the doctor the next day. Two days later, he flew home for 24 hours to, I think, North Carolina. And then he went to the doctor, had the blood draw, and he just got the uh, results three days ago. And he says, after seven days of treatments and the blood draw is on the November the 20th. And then two days uh, after that, he found out the granular filtration rate improved to 21.7 and the 2.2 points increase. And then the neph nephrologist says, you don't have to be on dialysis and you no longer need to be on the list of kidney transplant. Daily treatment, one hour, seven days, improving 2.2 points. That's incredible. So he keep on telling his doctor, acupuncture did it. And I was really excited about it. So I will share my screen. I will just show you yep. what did I do. That's impressive because I think a lot of time the patient with kidney disease, if they don't have a hope and don't see the whole improvement, it's very easy for them to give in. So even show a bit of improvement, you're going to save a life and save a person need to be on this dialysis or this surgery to vascular surgery and all the risks that come with it. I think that is showing any improvement for this type of patient will really start the journey and try to hold them not going to a dialysis. 